Hey guys, we're going to be back with another video, and today I am going to be reviewing Elite 78 Randy. This um, this video is just amazing. I play with this little all the time when I'm not making a video. Um, and we're going to have a match with him too. We're going to have a Fiend versus him uh, either next Friday or, um, I mean, upcoming Friday or um saturday so this is actually gonna be a really good match so please watch this and it's gonna be an ample intro match and a lot of you guys probably haven't like you probably you guys uh why'd you do the count why'd you do the count in cbw we kind of do the count but i'm gonna change up the rules now we're just gonna put them in the back and uh the opponent has to like knock on the back and, uh, and that's how he just wins and um yeah but uh, so we're gonna be reviewing Elite 78 Randy Orton today. So let's do it. So that is the Elite 78 Randy Orton. Uh, let me kind of get it. Let me get him close up. Um, the face cam is just amazing. It just looks like uh his new his new like uh look right now in 2020. And uh, they actually got the beard down too, so they they kind of show some uh, some parts of like the beard, like it's kind of saved, and there's some still kind of parts of the beard, but it's not black at all, it's just all uh, his skin tone. Um, here is the tights; these are so nice. This is where he fought Kofi Kingston at SummerSlam. I'm pretty sure. That's what it said on the back of the box. And I'm going to tell you guys, all these elites that come with um, the uh, on the back, that it says like, all the details about them, th that's just so great. I hope they do that for the basics, too, because I never really see those on my basics. But, uh, yeah, these this is just a really nice thing. Here are the knee pads. Uh, the knee pads are really nice. Sometimes they'll kind of just, like, slide down once you're kind of playing with them. Like, they'll just come down, uh, but they won't come off, that's a good thing. But, um, they'll just kind of slide down. You have to, like, push them up, kind of. If you want them all the way up, then you just push it up all the way. Uh, but I suggest kind of so so his knees. And, uh, yeah, and this is the perfect, perfect figure to, um, have when you had that SummerSlam and, um, WrestleMania basic ring. And I did review that, uh, yesterday, but I didn't drop it out yesterday. And I did drop out two videos today, and I'm going to be dropping out this um, on the day that I'm making the video. And on the day, I actually didn't get this figure today. I actually got it way back, like five weeks ago, but still, yeah, it's an amazing figure. And it does come with interchangeable hands. Uh, it comes with his little pose hands uh, when he's on the uh, turnbuckle and he does those little po that little pose. It comes with that hand, so if you want to do that pose, it's uh, so great. And um, here's the other one too. Comes with two, and uh, really nice uh, hand right there. And this is my favorite part um, of the figure. Sometimes on Randy Orton figures, they they really don't do this. They they it came with a jacket, and this is a SummerSlam jacket. And I think he kind of wore it to like Raw and stuff. Sometimes to Raw, but not anymore. It feels such a legend killer, but. Um, on the back, it says dues paid, and it has, like, a little snake around it. It looks so nice. It says R-K-O, and, um, if, I, I think everyone knows what that means. Randy strikes out of nowhere. But, uh, yeah, it's really nice. Sometimes kind of hard to put on, because you have to move his arm back, and you have to kind of bend it like that. But, uh, it's, it's, it's sometimes kind of easy. You just want to do the right arm first, because the right arm is, like, so easy to put in the uh, jack for the jacket but uh yeah um and now i feel like a summer slam figure though because this was he did actually wear this in summer so i don't know why it's not a summer figure but uh yeah but still i love the figure and uh, the crazy thing this was not supposed to come out in my city for two months but uh yeah so that's all for today guys Make sure to subscribe give me the 20 subscribers we're at like 16 right now um we only have four more and uh, go subscribe to A Star Pack Boy. Get them to at least 35 subscribers to 40. And uh, that's all. Peace out, Favors.